Magnetic micromanipulation has been applied to drug delivery, assembly of tissue constructs, and mechanical measurements for applications at the organ level, tissue level, and cell level. The aim of this work is to advance the technology further for realizing the fantastic voyage inside a single cell and perform mechanical measurements at the intracellular level. Intracellular manipulation and measurement can reveal the properties and functions of intracellular structures and organelles, which may directly link to cell migrations, mitosis, cardiac disease, and cancers. To achieve magnetic micromanipulation inside a single cell, a magnetic bead smaller than one micrometer must be introduced into the cell, 3D positioned to the desired locations inside the cell, and controlled to accurately apply pico-newton forces for intracellular measurements. We developed multi-pole magnetic tweezers for intracellular measurements. The system consists of a top stage and a bottom stage with positioning and alignment mechanisms. When the driving currents are applied in each coils, the magnetic bead will be actuated three-dimensionally. For controlling the submicron bead inside a cell under high-resolution visual feedback, the multi-pole magnetic tweezer system was integrated into a confocal microscope. The scaling down of the bead size causes bead mass to scale down by a factor of three. The small mass leads to a small inertia. Then, a small force disturbance induces large deviations of bead position. Besides, the low visual feedback rate from the confocal microscope induces large overshoot and settling time in position control. Here, a generalized predictive control algorithm was developed taking into account bead dynamics and the low bandwidth high resolution imaging feedback. The generated magnetic force was experimentally cal calibrated through navigating 0.7 micrometer magnetic beads. This was done in silicon oil with known viscosities. Then the magnetic force was quantified by calculating the balancing fluidic drag force and compared with the theoretically calculated force values. After force calibration, the bead was navigated towards different locations onto the cell nucleus, then apply a force of 50 piconewton. The deformation was recorded and quantified with subpixel resolution of 0.2 micron. Relating the force and deformation through Hertz model, the apparent Young's modulus of cell nucleus in both minor and major axis were calculated. The results showed that the cell nucleus exhibits a strong polarity that the major axis is significantly stiffer than the minor axis, which may be attributed to the aligned stress fibers inside the cell. With the help of this intracellular measurement tool, more biophysical parameters will be quantified and observed inside a cell, and will provide better understanding of how intracellular properties related to cell behaviors and diseases.